G'day guys, Steve from SNR Caribbean Solutions. Over the past week we've been working on this Dodge Ram 2500 Heavy Duty and the Lotus Trooper. Came to us for quite a few upgrades, solar upgrade, battery upgrade, um, and basically check over the wiring that was already pre-done. What we discovered though was um, that the vehicle was struggling to charge the um, caravan it already has twin alternators on this so the customer had the forethought of putting twin alternators so that it could charge such a large off-grid system but they were just using a 50 amp anderson plug um, on 8 b and s cable which isn't enough so what we've done is we've put in a 100 amp circuit breaker 100 amp vsr we've put really thick 2 b and s cable down the back of the ute we're running a now 120 amp anderson plug again two bns cable and to increase um earth we're actually using the caravan as earth the caravan chassis is a great earth rather than just using you know the cable running all the way through to the to the batteries in this we've decided to use the caravan earth because it's a good earth um it's got a manager 30 so at the moment we've got aircon bit of solar running and it's pulling 50 amps we've um, pulled out the btec 300 and replaced it with the power pool 280 amp scout batteries so doubled the capacity um, we've rewired basically what lotus had done it was really insufficient um, for this type of setup so now it has a BC DC 50 in there plus the manager 30 um, and now we'll easily see 80 plus amps coming from the uh, the Dodge Ram which will be more than enough charging at idle um, so that the customer won't have to um, run a generator or anything like that. So what we might go do is start it and show you the difference. It's a really nice rig, really well thought out. Um, got a nice canopy with another full setup inside, fridge and a drive setup. It's running an inverter, um, all the fruit. We'll just come round. jump in I just put my phone down and I just thought so that's the second alternator just there um, so it's primarily charging the auxiliary battery and the caravan back to the caravan right the manager 30 so now we've got the manager 30 going and plus the BCDC 50 Aircon's running and we're still putting in 30 amps. So that's a huge gain. Aircon running, solar running, car running, and we're putting in plus 30 into the batteries with the AC running. Pretty amazing feat, but it is possible. Um, it's just a matter of having the right equipment to do the job. All right, guys, thank you. So car running, and we're making well, 81 so amps. So car running and we're making 81 amps coming into the batteries. How good is that?